Woohoo! Fire this thing up. We are in the thrill capital of the world on the Rev. I'm trying to get them to let me go on this roller coaster, but the reality is the state will not allow it until next week when Six Flags Magic Mountain opens back up to the public. No joke, on April 1st, 260 acres of fun is back. With more than 100 rides, 19 roller coasters at Six Flags Magic Mountain, including Revolution. The first looping coaster on the planet. And West Coast Racers that opened up just before the pandemic shut it down. But the best part of it is, is it's themed like West Coast Customs car, and you get to race around twice twice lapping and you know you get to see who wins so it's great it's a great experience and it's aimed to be a safe one with mandatory masks plexiglass and social distancing markers and constant sanitation do the six as they now say at six flags basically have fun safely and it starts at the entrance by now we're all familiar with these thermometers you go into a restaurant for example and they zap your forehead and take your temperature this is much more efficient for an amusement park it's a tunnel basically that you walk through and as you're walking it takes your temperature it's contactless and it streamlines the process you'll also go through a security screening more high tech than metal detectors you can leave everything in your pockets it pinpoints concerning objects if i walked in with my keys right now that wouldn't show off as a potential object but if we walked with this microphone, for example, it might show as a potential weapon. At that point, you'll go to secondary screening with some of our security team members, and they'll ensure that it's not a weapon. Then it's all about having a good time again at the first amusement park in the region to reopen its rides. All the theme parks are going to be opening soon, and we're looking forward to being amongst them and bringing back the thrills to Southern California. It's a bit eerie being this close to the rides and it being so quiet, but soon the roar of those roller coasters will be back. You do have to make a reservation, but you can cancel it up to the last minute. Reporting live in Valencia, I'm Haley Winslow. Back to you guys. All right, Haley, we want to hear about employees and getting their jobs back, but also are we allowed to do the woohoo and the screams? <laughs> That is a must, as long as you have your mask on, of course. The health experts say that you, I did hear something about no screaming on rides, and I don't know how they're going to mandate that, especially with that new roller coaster. As for the employees go, yes, they are hiring 1,500 total. The former employees were the first ones. They got first dibs if they wanted their jobs back, but they are looking for more people. And hey, a perk is you get to go on a roller coaster on your lunch break. Can't beat that. That is a perk. I'll think about it. All right, Haley, thanks very much. <laughs>